So I have spent my whole educational career in Missouri up to this point, but Southwest and South Central Missouri. So I'm pretty much an Arkansas. I mean, we're close enough, right? Um, so West Plains is where I spent most of my life and most of my career. If you don't know where West Plains is, it's South Central Missouri. It's about 20 miles or so from the Arkansas border. Uh, if you know where Mountain Home is, it's about 50 miles northeast of Mountain Home. Okay, um, so that's where I spent most of my life. My dad is a minister, and uh, he grew up in South Florida. Now I have to tell you something really sad. So he grew up in Sarasota, Florida, and I shared this with our district leadership team Monday, that his claim to fame is he went to school with Pee Wee Herman. <laughs> and then later that day, after I told them, we got the notification that he passed away. So Alan asked me to please not name drop anymore. So, so I, I stopped name dropping at that point. But so my dad grew up in Sarasota, Florida. Uh, we went spent my early years in South Florida, and then we moved to West Plains when I was a teenager. And I spent all my life there until 2018. Uh, I started as a teacher and a coach at West Plains. Worked my way all the way up to superintendent there, and was superintendent for five years at West Plains. I uh, was a middle school and high school administrator as well as an assistant superintendent in the district. From there, I went to the St. Louis area, a little community called Pacific, which is, if you've ever been to St. Louis and driven by Six Flags theme park, your Pacific is basically right there, okay? And so I was there for three years as superintendent, thought I would retire from there, had an opportunity to go to Springfield and work with Dr. Granita Lathan. Um, at Springfield. Springfield is Missouri's largest school district of 25,000 students. And Dr. is kind of a, I shared with our team, uh, Dr. Lathan came from Texas, but uh, it's kind of a big step for Southwest Missouri because all at once Springfield hired their first female superintendent and their first minority superintendent. And so uh, she was looking for an experienced Missouri superintendent to come work alongside her. And she offered me that opportunity and, uh, and I jumped at it and had a great, great opportunity, great time working with Dr. Lathan and uh, spent the last two years there. And then I retired from Missouri and that's what brought me to Fayetteville. And quite frankly, I didn't even know if I would stay in education. I thought I may want to try something completely different. And the more I, I looked at Fayetteville and the school district and the community, the more excited I got about the opportunity that we have here to do some really great things as we look ahead over the next five to 10 years. And uh, that's what led me to, to apply and, and ultimately become the next superintendent. So that's what brought me here. And I can't tell you that I'm, I'm super excited to be here. And we've got a great team, we've got great people, an excellent foundation. Uh, and I'm just excited to get started. So with that said, does anybody